Ooh. Assam give a suspicious look to Dominic Angel. I saw a look pass between them. I wonder. Well, Corey's my broadcast partner tonight. He, he's not involved in this match, so I don't think anything's going to happen. Corey, did I, was it me or did I just see a look pass between you and uh, Dominic Angel over there? I'm proud of him, man. I mean, the show that I run is called Evolving with Corey Castle, and that is exactly what I've seen Angel do. He's done nothing but evolve who he was when he first got here into this person who can tell compelling stories and really be confident in his words. Contrary to popular belief, Miles Hawkins did barely win his title by cashing in his money, his uh, Stairway to Heaven briefcase. Stairway to Glory. Stairway to Glory briefcase. There is no Stairway to Heaven. Denied. Wow. Good one, Corey. We haven't, can we, can we make sure we don't gloss over the fact that the ring announcer said that Miles was from Florida. I knew I didn't like him for some reason. There it is. Florida's gross. Get ready. Give me a bell. Whatever have you got against Florida? It, it sucks. And there's lots of, lots of, lots of critters down there who will kill you. Well, oh, look at that. Uh, uh, a handshake between the two of them. That's good. Yes. Corey, Corey, you, you sit down, please. Sit down, please. You don't have to be uh, so overdramatic. I, dude, this guy's my friend. I'm, I'm wanting to support him. But you're, you're, you're broadcasting. To we have to call a match. We're going to be impartial. All right. We're going to be impartial. Impressive head scissors by Angel. You see, you see Miles grabbing the hair. I don't see nobody, a head. Nobody, nope. nobody can... Nobody can defend against that that's you're, you're trying that's to say a, he's a decent that's champion. a headlock that's a fair headlock he's takedown. right by the hair that's a fair headlock takedown Corey being you're, I think you're being a tad over biased look at it oh look how miles got out of that that was that was a good just a, look just look at the the smoothness in the motion of dominant and miles too they are they're both uh equally matched it's it's a it's a good competition look here look at that tight collar that will tie up and look how uh miles is locked in that headlock Shoulder tackle by he's Miles. Not, he's not facing. He's, he's good. Angel goes down again. Drop down. Hip. Dominic Angel with the hip toss. Oh. Miles Kicked kicks up. him off. Big body slam by Miles Hawkins. Again, Dominic Angel kicks him off. Good exchange between the two of them. Good exchange. Angel's got something to prove to his friend here. He's sincere in his message of, uh, look, he made me wear my broadcasting hat today. I'm here broadcasting. I'm not even allowed to be ringside. Oh. Oh, going back and forth. Control look, keeps going back and forth look, between. Too much hesitation from Miles there, and, and Angel got the better of him. Now it's now going it's back and forth. No, no, look, look. Miles is uh, trying to get out of it, and he's backing him into the corner. Which is going to force the break. Oh, there you go. Oh, no. he hit him right in his eye. No, hey, hey. He hit him right in his that eye. Was, you saw that. He did not rake his eyes. I was looking. My, I think uh, my, uh, Miles, Miles is uh, being not framed here. a clean here. break, but he hit him in his eye. Dominic D'Angelo's trying to pull something here. You call that a clean break? You call that a clean break? He didn't break his jaw. Uh, impactful suplex. Uh, Dominic Angel exhibiting a bit more viciousness than he did when he first started this match. Follow, follow it up. Follow it up, Angel. Hey, you're here as a broadcaster, not a manager, Corey. Take, take it home. Again, Corey, you're broadcasting. You don't give him any, any help. 
Miles Hawkins with the elbow. But can you imagine the DCW Heavyweight Championship and the DCW No Limit Championship being inside the Spark? That's that's a banner day for the Spark. That's exactly that's exactly why I I try to groom this this young stud of Dominic Angel to be championship material. I've evolved into the impressive specimen you're seeing right here when it comes to when it comes to strategy, when it comes to To, to be fair, Dominic is, do, is doing well right now for himself. Miles with a kick out. I don't know if you've noticed it, but but look how smooth the transitions and on top of that, I mean, something we don't take enough consideration just being fans and watching wrestling is the, the ring positioning is super you know, important. And I, Dominic I think, I think has you're that. being a bit biased towards uh, Mr. Dominic Angel here, Corey Castle. What do you think about Miles' performance? I think Miles Hawkins is also doing very well for himself tonight. He's overrated. But again, you're supposed to be an unbiased uh, broadcaster. Will you here. ask me my opinion? He's overrated, but yet he's the champion. He's just a. Uh, he cashed in unfairly. That Un unfairly? Yeah. He won a stairway to heaven. Look at, Look at that suplex by Miles Hawkins. Tell me that wasn't that wasn't a thing of beauty. Dominic Angel looks rocked. With the clothesline. Flying clothesline. That was a four. That was an elbow. Power slam. There we go. I'm going for the pin. You hear how unbiased I'm being? I called that. Yes, see, you did. Yes, you did. Slam. We should see more of this from you. This, I like this side of you. See? See? We're all evolving. And again with the cheap draw. Oh, I don't even know what that... That was a flying back kick by Miles Hawkins. Wow, that looked good. Oh! Landed on his feet with a moonsault off the top. And, oh, Dominic Gange has to poke him in the eyes. It's, it's, what kind of what kind of cheap move was that? It's funny. You just, you you got so impressed by him missing a moonsault. He landed on his feet. He anticipated and compensated for it. So, yes, that's impressive. The crowd firmly behind Miles Hawkins in this match. Okay, good suplex by Corey. Where are you going, Corey? My broadcast uh, partner has decided to uh, stand up. What, Corey? What are you doing? He's grabbed. He's grabbed. What is he? He's grabbed the hammer. Corey. Corey, come back to the broadcast table. What is he doing? Corey. Corey Castle is. He's approached the ring with the ring bell hammer in his hand. What? What is he? What is he planning here? Corey, come back to the ring. You're not involved in this. You're not even on the cart. Corey Castle has just slid the ring hammer to Dominic Angel. I can't believe he did that. I can't believe you did that. What did you just do? You're not ringside now. What did you just do? You slid Dominic Angel the, the hammer. Oh, but Miles ducks it anyway. Oh, and with a double boot. Guess that... Uh, didn't matter, did it, Corey? Nice try there. Oh, right. Miles Hawkins to the top rope. What's he going to do here? Oh! Flying elbow. Oh, my gosh. What a hold. What a move. One, two, three, and that's it. That's it. Gee, I wonder why she couldn't ring the bell, Corey Castle. Why couldn't she ring the bell? What, what do you call it? Do you have any work, anything to say for yourself, Corey Castle? I don't have to justify myself to you. You got up and handed Dominic Angel the ring bell. I did nothing of the sort. I saw you with my own two eyes. You tried to cheat, and it backfired on you regardless. Listen to that. The crowd loves Miles even more because of what you did. So nice job, Corey, in oh, helping us. Yeah, because he's got you gave weapon. it to him. You gave it to That's him. Unprofessional. Why don't you take That's it back? unprofessional. Why don't you take it back? That's a champion in your eyes. That unprofessional. Yes. Who gave him a weapon? How did how did that get in the ring? How did that hammer get in the ring, Corey Castle? What do you have to say well, for yourself? Shut up! The deeds is out here now. And now Sonny Deeds complimenting Miles Hawkins on a successful title defense. 
Oh, he's asking. I think Sonny Deeds is asking for a rematch, I believe. Okay, shook his hand. That's that's good sportsmanship from Sonny Deeds. Unlike this person I'm sitting next to here. Oh, and look at this. You call that good sportsmanship? Dominic Angel hitting Sonny Deeds from behind. What do you call that? Yeah, there you go. And he deserves that. He hit Sonny Deeds from behind. Exactly, exactly. Chastising Dominic Angel is uh, Miles Hawkins. That is bad. That's not bad. Wait a minute. Why is, why is Sonny Deeds doing that? Why did he feel the need to soup to give Miles Hawkins a spine buster? I hope you can live with yourself, Corey Castle. Sonny Deeds clearly sending a message to Miles Hawkins here. Message being, I want my rematch. <laughs> He could have sent it another way, but message received and understood, I believe. Now with that brings another end, brings an end to another episode of DCW Overdrive. So for myself, Craig Turner Guest, and my co-host, the uh, questionable Corey Castle. Say, you could say the broadcast journalist and DCW No Limit Champion. Corey Castle. Yes, with questionable ethics, I will add as well. We wish you a good night, and we'll see you next week.